Louis typewriter. At school, Bluey is being a story writer. Chloe comes to tell that it's time for a story with Calypso. Tick, 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 ching, tick, 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 ching. Everyone sits up straight to listen. Snicker tries and tries, but oops. <laughs> Calypso begins. There once was an old dog who had sat on a chest by the side of the road for all his life, begging for treats. One day, a gnome came by and said to the old dog, have you tried opening that chest you sit on to see what's inside? Oh, no, of course not. There's nothing inside, said the old dog. It is empty. <laughs> Can I sit next to you, Coco? Says Winton. He sits right up close to her. Winton is a space invader. <laughs> the gnome insisted that the old dog open the chest, and when he did, he discovered that it was full of treats. Lou doesn't think the story makes sense. <laughs> So she decides to write a new one with a better ending. But when she and Chloe get back to the typewriter, it's gone. Hey, where'd the real typewriter go? I'll go ask Calypso, says Bluey. I can't be a story writer without a real typewriter. <whistles> On her way to find Calypso, Bluey sees Snickers. He looks sad. Hey, Snicker, what's wrong? Here, everyone has learned to sit except me. But you're a sausage dog, says Bluey. It's going to take you longer because you're longer. I hate being a sausage dog, Snicker moans. <laughs> Bluey suggests that Snickers come to find Calypso to see if she can help them both. On the way, they bump into Winston. He looks sad, too. Hey, Winston, what's wrong? Everyone keeps running away from me. Why don't you come to see Calypso with us, asks Bluey. Maybe she can help. Okay, says Winston. I'll follow you. The three friends head off until they are stopped by. The Terriers, they are playing a game. Hey, we're shooting bows and arrows at you, the terrier said when Bluey, Snickers, and Winston don't fall over. Not real one, says Snickers. Please, can you pretend that they're pretend real? <laughs> okay, Bluey says. She yells to Snicker and Winston. Arrows, get down. They race away from the pretend real arrows. <laughs> Snickers, you can... Sneakers, you sneak around them through those skinny trees, Bluey says, and then wait at the top of the hill to do you know what. <laughs> I'm coming. Where are you? <laughs> Sneakers sneaks through the skinny trees as the terrier tries to spot him, but Sneakers' sausage shake keeps him hidden. <laughs> oh, I didn't notice that. Hold on, let me go back. Sneakers took out, took off the hat. Right there. See? It's right there. Meanwhile, Bluey has an idea for getting past one of the other terriers. Ask him a question, she tells Winton, and then he'll run away. Winton is confused. Why would he run away if I asked a question? Because you're a space invader. It is someone who stands too close. Winton gives it a go. Are you gluten-free? <laughs> Winton, not so close. Just tell me, are you gluten-free? Ah, it works. <laughs> are you gluten-free? <laughs> The last terrier has them trapped, but Winton has an idea. Use this shield, he says, handing Bluey a pretend real shield. Okay, says Bluey, hang on. <laughs> we're doing, we're doing, bing, bing, bing. <laughs> they escape and scare the terrier away. <laughs> Bluey and Winton run away up the hill, but the terrier soon chase them. Bluey shouts to Snickers, Snickers now. Sausage roll, I love being a sausage dog. <laughs> Good one, Snickers. Bluey and Winston shout. Then Bluey laughs. Hey, Winston, look. Winston isn't standing close. I'm not a space invader. <laughs> Finally, Bluey asks Calypso where the real typewriter has gone. It's around here somewhere, says Calypso. Hey, how did you get past the terriers? I use the shield, says Bluey. See? Ting, ting. That's a nice shield. Okay, typewriter. Where is it? Calypso smiles. What if I ask you to show me a typewriter? Bluey shows Calypso a pretend real typewriter, just like she used the pretend real shield to escape the terriers. Tee 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 ching. That's a lovely typewriter, isn't it? Says Calypso. Thanks, Calypso, says Bluey as she races off. I'm going to write my story now. <laughs> it is a lovely typewriter, and Bluey will always have it with her. Think of the typewriter. The end. <laughs>